Welcome to our podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, we explore how newborn girls have more complex brains. New research by researchers at the University of Tübingen in Germany has revealed that brain activity in baby girls is more complex than that in baby boys. They came to this conclusion by measuring the magnetic fields produced by the brain's electrical currents in fetuses and babies to sound stimuli using an imaging technique called magnetoencephalography, or MEG. Data from 20 newborns ages 13 to 59 days and 43 third trimester fetuses was analyzed by the scientists. The sound stimuli included various arrangements of beeps. The sound was played to the fetuses using a sound balloon tucked between the pregnant woman's belly and the MEG sensors. The data analysis revealed that when the neurological system grows in fetuses and newborns, the complexity of signals in the brain appears to diminish, with boys developing this system substantially quicker than girls. The researchers then measured their magnetic brain activity in response to sound stimulation. They used algorithms to generate a variety of metrics that represent the complexity of the MEG signal. Researchers found that people with greater degrees of brain complexity have superior performance and faster reaction time in essential executive tasks, such as planning and decision-making. Low levels, on the other hand, are associated with states in which information processing ability is impaired, such as general anesthesia and non-rapid eye movement sleep. The researchers expected the complexity of brain signals to increase as fetuses grew and babies aged. However, they found it decreased faster in males than females. The reason is uncertain, but it may be because the brain simplifies its processes during development by removing unnecessary cells and connections. As the brain matures, it moves toward ordered patterns of neural connections which tell it how to respond to stimuli, such as the beeps in our experiment. A more developed brain has fewer ways of responding to that stimulus, and thus, lower complexity. If we were to look at spontaneous activity, we might see something different, the lead author of the study, Joel Froelich, said. The researchers think that the differences between boys and girls might be because their nervous systems develop differently. However, they didn't continue studying the babies afterward, so it's not known if these differences persist. Thanks for tuning into this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.